Hey guys, what's going on? It's multi Tutor Man, and I'm back yet again with another how to computer tutorial. And for this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys uh, how to fix the Elder Scrolls Skyrim uh, launcher loop. So when you click play, what happens is here it comes, here it comes. Yeah, so you get install instead of play here, even though you've already installed it. And so this video is if you've already tried to. Um, uh, make sure the cache is alright. So, uh, one of the fixes that many people recommend is right clicking Skyrim, in properties, uh, local files, and then verify integrity of game cache. And so that'll just make sure all your files are okay. So, if you've already done that, if you've already reinstalled Skyrim again and it's still not working, this is the fix for you. So, first thing we're going to want to do is open up our file explorer, head on over to our hard drive. Go to program files, uh, just find your steam folder, steam apps, common, Skyrim, and you should find the Skyrim launcher and this TESV in here. So first we're going to want to right click Skyrim launcher, go to properties, compatibility, and check run this program in compatibility mode for Windows 7 and run this program as an administrator. So apply, OK. And then we're going to do the same thing for TESV. OK, that should do it. And so, all right, so now what we're going to want to do is just restart Steam. OK. You could actually launch it right now if you wanted to. You could just go ahead and open up the Skyrim. Uh, just double click on Skyrim Launcher. If you want to load your mods, if you want to get right into the game, you could open up TESV and that would put you right into the game. And you could also open it from here. That's why we had to restart it. So let me just show you that works. Just click play. Voila. And there you go. There you, there you have it. Um, so this has been my first video back in a while. So I hope you enjoyed it. So this is Multi-Tutor Man signing out.